our exclusive one-on-one -on -one interview with Vice President Joe Biden. He's in town tonight for a campaign fundraiser for Ted Strickland. And earlier, he was at the Langston Hughes Community Health Center to talk about the administration's plans to accelerate cancer research. And our Leon Bibb spoke with the Vice President after his event. It was a vice president who spoke not only as a political figure leading the government's push to fight cancer, but also as a father of a son who died of cancer. Vice President Joe Biden was in Cleveland speaking on the national push to further research cancer and for researchers to share their findings with a push for a cure. I asked him after his moonshot summit on cancer, his first stop was in Cleveland. Why this city? Cleveland is doing the kind of thing we need to be doing. I wanted to showcase exactly the kind of work being done, particularly in communities that don't get access very often mm -hmm. to the care and the detection capabilities. The vice president said it was important for cancer researchers to share their information and to work connected with each other. We got to have joint science instead of deciding we're just working, I'm working all by myself in my lab. I got to share the information I find, especially when I get federal funding to develop it. It is a connecting of the dots and a connecting of the cancer research information. The vice president said he was impressed with what he has seen in Cleveland's medical community. Covering the vice president's visit to the city, this is Leon Bibb, News Channel 5, Cleveland.